Greetings everyone, this is BJ Black from No Export For You and welcome to part 33 of my Let's Play of Monmouth's Quest Paradox RPG, Confrontation Chapter. This isn't exactly an alias aside, but I'm going through the new content that came out in the 2.20 patch. 2.20 version, rather. There was no patch, they just released the full version. No, we're not getting Amira. So this one is for Barney, our bunny girl. She wants to get better at her bow and arrow work. So she'd like to learn the techniques passed down by the elves. They kind of don't share it with outsiders, however. But we want to ask, so can we help? Well, elf bow techniques, huh? How about we consult with the Queen Elf? So naturally we have to have the Queen Elf recruited before we can do this. So Barney says, um, I would like you to teach me Elf Bow Techniques. Would you please? Well, because we're allies in this, it can't be helped. So, let's go to the Island of Fairies and do the training. Well, thank you very much. Usasa! So, Usako, Usa is also going to come along. Yep. I'm going together with <laughs> a Big Sis Rabbit. So she'll do the training too. Alright, let's do our best. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. With just a little training, Barney's actually gotten pretty good. And Usa is. Well, keep doing your best. So, thank you very much. She gets multiple arrow. If you continue like this in another hundred years or so. You'll get to the really good stuff. A hundred years, huh? That's a long path to take. Yo, this is good. <clears throat> so, hey, hey, hey. Rather than piling training upon training, there is a better method. If you want to come to the elf bow techniques, it'd be best to become an elf. With this forest X injected in you, you too will become an elf. I'll become an elf. I kind of don't want to be slutty like them. Elves are not slutty. How rude. It's all right, there's nothing to be afraid of. Come, become an elf. Hmm. Well, if I can learn the elf techniques, then... All right, give me that injection. So, here we go. This may sting. Hmm, somehow, I feel like I need to protect the forest. How sweet. Alright, she's an elf now. We did it. The experiment is a success. With this, our beast type and monsters can become elves. Yay, how nice. Hmm. To think that I would gain a new kin by this method. Well, continue with your training. And... Don't bring shame upon the names of the elves. All right, queen. My queen, whatever. Hey, 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 hey. She's thinking something slutty. Yep, just a little. She's gotten looter. Usa Usa Ero. So great, now that that's done. Next up, 
No, we're not getting a mirror. All right. Anybody who wants to learn the techniques of other monster types, please come to me. I have science to solve it with. Okay. Zaki wants to know to add to her dance repertory. She'd like to add the techniques of sea monsters. All right, let's go talk to Promistine. It's probably going to be another ejection. Hmm. I could swear that one of these, if you check the bulletin a second time, it won't come up again. It might have been the one with Barney. So pay attention. It may not tell you again. So, you want to consult with me regarding changes to other monster types? Yep. Saki wants to learn aquatic... Aquatic monster dances. They have dances. Wakame also wants to learn sea dances. And Jillian has no interest in dances at all, but as a, as a crab type mecha, she wants to come closer to being a true crab. Alright then, the three of you get to become sea aquatic types. So then, take this injection and... Ah, oh, wait right there. Don't go... Don't get ahead of us. If you want to learn the dances of the sea, there's another method. What is it? What is it? Tell me, tell me. Tell us. Well, passed down from old days, the Ryugu tr trials are something that uh, can be done. If you clear these trials, you get to learn the Ryugu dance. The Ryugu is the name of a certain castle in Japanese and Chinese legend. In any case, it's one of those aquatic related ledge myths. So, the Ryugu trials have already been are administered by us. So let's go to Natalia. Natalia Beach. Okay, Natalia Beach is west of Natalia Port. Thank you. So then, let's go. Let's go. You know, I really don't care about these dances. Ah, oh, damn it. They took my chance. Oh, okay then. Let's go to Natalia Beach. This uh, Ryugu trial or whatever. Wonder what it's gonna be. Mm, Natalia Port. Okay, we came to Natalia Beach. So where's this Ryugu trial? So it's already started. Just continue ahead like this. But you must not forget, in order to pass the trial, you need to demonstrate right in righteousness in your heart. Those who are righteous in their heart know what to do when they see someone, when they see the weak oppressed, being oppressed. Well, I can't see any more than that. Hmm, this should be easy then. Gee, it sure is fun picking on turtles. Picking on turtles is the best. Our hobby is picking on turtles. If you don't stop us, we're just going to continue this way picking on him. Her. They're picking on me. Help me. Am I doing it right? This is kind of ridiculous, the situation. Ah, what a coincidence to see a turtle being picked on. So, righteous ones, do you know what you need to do? Are you going to save the weak one, or are you going to see it and act like you didn't? 
Zuzun. I guess she sneezed or something. Or stumbled or whatever. Okay, Namako. Help, we're gonna be crushed. Please save us quickly. So, whom do we save here? Hey, you can't go picking on weaklings. Yeah, that's no good. Mm, sorry, I overdid it. You know, I still don't know where I recruit that girl. Oh, well. Oh, thanks for saving us. A little more of that and we'd have been squashed into dust. As thanks, we'll take you to the Ryugu Castle. Huh. Aren't the ones who are supposed to be invited to the Ryugu Ta- The Ryugu Castle supposed to be you guys? And when are we going to be done with this crap? Yeah ha 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 Yeah ha 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 Glug 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 Another round! So, the Ryugu castle that was in, in the end The Seafloor Temple And we're just having a feast La 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 Ryugu dance La 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 Alright, that's how you move your feet your steps and turns are getting good. <laughs> Let's keep on with the booze. So, why am I doing this too? The three of them learn the Ryugu dance. Great. So, next up would be the Sazanami dance. These sea dances, uh, I want to learn all of them. Great. The Sazanami dance. In that case, you need to take the trial of Sazanami. Yeah, you'll have to wait a little while there. It'll take some time to put it together. So, there are more trials. Well, if it's dance lessons, I can take it as long as I want, but these weird trials, I'm already kind of sick of. Oh, great. Well, this is as I expected. These trials are, as, as anticipated, a waste of time. Rather than playing along with these spiritual lessons or whatnot, how about we... Hey, what's that? What's up with that unpleasant background music? It's making my booze taste bad. I'm changing it back. Ah. Anyway, if we have this injection, then the trials will be unnecessary. If you become aquatic types, the aquatic type dances will come to you naturally. But this medicine is still in the process of research. It's a little, in, it's a little incomplete. So, this is kind of the clinical trial. Well, does that mean there's going to be side effects? Hmm, no. On the other hand, the effect may be too, too uh, superficial. If the person receiving the injection is not suited to it, then there won't be any change. I can't even say that everybody will become aquatic types by doing this. But, will you accept the injections? Of course, I'll take the chance. Yeah, I'll do it. Yes, that's what I want. So, Jillian's going to get what she wants. Okay then, yeah! Mm, Saki says, somehow, I feel as big as the sea. Yeah, whatever. And I feel the sea, too. Hmm. The DNA of the sea is taking root in my body. Yeah, as expected of a mecha. She says it very 
scientifically. So it seems it was successful on all three of them. How wonderful. These are wonderful results. And I've come to a realization. Seaweed is a primitive form of plant life. So we take this seaweed that's become an aquatic animal and harvest some cells. If you put it in miso shiro, it tastes good. Well, I'll do that with what remains after my experiment. Probably with this, I can change plant type monsters into aquatic type monsters. Well, I don't know what's going on here, but that's great. Yeah, ha ha ha. Glug, glug, glug. Another round! Yep, let's keep drinking. So, the feast continues until the morning. Ryugu dance. Are we done yet? Let's see. No, we're not recruiting Amira. So, those who want to learn techniques of other types... Anybody? Anybody? I'll solve that with the power of science. Hi, Elizabeth. So, she wants to learn... She is a high-class rapier user. But the really good rapier techniques are kept by the phantasms. Well, I should clarify. Yoma is the Japanese word, and sometimes it's translated as demon, but I'm going to stick with Akuma being demon, so Yoma, I'm going to say, is a phantasm. In any case, they're high-class monsters, and they have good rapier techniques. Okay, let's go to Promistine and consult with her. Of course, this is going to turn into another injection. We're in the Alias route, so this is going to be missing the funny that comes in the Alice route. Okay, so, anybody who wants to learn the techniques of another type, solve it with the power of science. She's repeating herself. Elizabeth says she wants to learn stronger rapier techniques, so she wants to become a phantasm. Okay then. In that case, I'm going to take some DNA I got from the Mao and make some medicine. How did you get Alice Fees' DNA? We were there together with her in Grand Noah at the feast, remember? I took the glass that the Mao used and harvested her DNA from it. I'm surprised she didn't eat the glass. That's kind of scary. So then, taking this DNA from the Mao and mixing in the secret that and the secret this. Mixing, mixing. And I'm done. If we inject this medicine, then terrestrial monsters can become phantasms. So, will you do it? It's alright. I'm prepared. All right, give me your arm. Yeah. In my body, I feel a burning power. This is the power of the phantasms. Great, works perfectly. The experiment has been a success. This medicine's name is Demon X. Let's make it. So, we've run out of jokes for the names. Ah, I've even let down Usa. Now, the joke is that it isn't a joke, don't you get it? <clears throat> okay then. In any case, now the terrestrial time monsters can become Yoma. Promising's research is continuing pretty well, isn't it? Yes, it's going very well, if I do say so myself. 
if we continue like this in the end we will <laughs> this is somehow scary it didn't say what this was called but the X that changes the plant types into aquatic types is called dried squid X no, I need uh, dried squids, which I don't have any of, and enwrapping tentacles. Oh yeah, I don't have any. So all of these require this or that. This one takes three skulls and three crystals of strange power. So yeah. Apparently, once we get into the final chapter, she may actually be able to do a round trip. So that every mo every character can become every monster type, and also humans maybe. You know, I'm kind of expecting Chrome to jump in at some point here. She was doing research on turning Frederica into a doll from being her current state, which is zombie. But we're done here at the bulletin board, so I guess we're done. Although, I guess I haven't recruited Chrome in this game. In any case, I've checked with my other saves. And this is the end for now. So, there's another thing that's been added to the 2.20 version. And that is a remastering of the Labyrinth of Chaos. Which you may remember from the Catalyst chapter. Oh, look at this. This is my first time in. So, the way to the Labyrinth of Chaos has been opened. It seems to be responding to you guys' power. If you want to go there, check on the bookcase. Well, I'm actually going to cut before going to the Labyrinth of Chaos, but... The Shinigami has some new things. This is what she always says the first time you talk to her. So, you can challenge her to a fight. New game plus. You can remove male characters from your party. This is the characters like the guard in the in Eliasville, whom you can recruit. A couple of perverts in Pornoff and the head guard of the Sabasa Kingdom and the head guard of the San Ilia Kingdom. All of those males you can purge. You can't purge the damn Pope as much as you may want to. As much as you should want to. Uh, wait, no. Now in this version, it says you can erase all males from the party. So, great. Well, since we're here, I want to re remove all of the males. I understood. I'll remove all males from your party. Including you. Yeah! Wait, wait, wait. Shinigami, no, no, you know what I mean. Fuck. Eraser of oneself. It's a pretty cheesy. Hmm. Normally when we die, it resets our... It um, refills our life. So that's one new thing. I think there's another new thing. Oh yes. Whoops. This new option allows you to reset the growth of every character. So you can take a character and reset their stats, their levels, their abilities, back to when they first joined your party. Now this is a warning, if you do this it can't be undone. Except, you know, by grinding them back up to where you got them. Okay, so whom will you do? Um, actually, I'm going to cancel. I'm going to tell you that in this version, 2.20, it's supposed to work, but every time I do it, the next time I open my menu, the game crashes on me. 
Perhaps it will work for you, but uh, at the moment I'm not going to try it again. So that'll be it for this chapter. And next time I'm going to come and show you what's in the new Labyrinth of Chaos. So, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.